Hey guys, what's up? Uh, welcome back to my Kid Icarus Uprising video walkthrough, part 23 now, I think. Um, today we're going to do chapter 13, the Lunar Sanctum, and take out one of uh, Freddy's commanders. Basically just like we did for the Underworld. Um, take out their commanders. So, yeah. Oh my gosh, I love that song. I actually saw an interview with Pitt and he uh, sung that song. I was like, oh my god. That's so cute. I love that song though. Yes, there are two moons. That is creepy. Yeah, it's it's kind of creepy. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Two moons, and moon um, it launches lasers at you. So watch out. Yeah, lasers. So you just want to dodge lasers. Um, they're pretty easy do to dodge due to the fact that they uh, go very slowly. So uh, and uh, Palutena evades uh, the attacks because she makes you fly. So yeah. Uh, just kill the monsters and you'll be fine. It gets faster as you get in there, but you'll you'll probably be okay if you just evade them. And there's more than one laser just firing at one time. Yeah. Oh, there's three. Yeah. Yeah, Orlan's kind of like a snobby, rich kid type person. Uh, he's not, he's, this isn't probably the, yeah, this is the only chapter he's in. Um, I consider, I think he's a very good voice actor for the game. Um, but still, my favorite's Hades, because he has a lot of jokes. Yeah, but he's one of the uh, Forces of Nature's commanders. Pretty good. Just destroy the flower things and lasers. <laughs> so weird. So, like, I'm trying to make a video every day on uh, this walkthrough. I haven't been able to make a review for like a week now, so I've been too busy with this, and uh, I really can't wait till this fall when I start making two walkthroughs at a time. Oh my god, that would be so fun. But for uh, summer right now, I'll, I only have, I'll only make one. And there is no Zodiac weapon in this chapter, so, yeah. Seems like every even chapter is a Zodiac weapon. And a laser launches at you. It's amazing she sees these doorways that are just randomly there, um, through the laser, so, yeah, she, she usually finds the best way into places. Uh, yeah. So there's like a little corridor here that you go in. It's not safe here. Just to defeat the enemies here. Yeah, it's thinning out. Yeah. It's so weird. No. Hmm. Strike through the fancy. So just evade the lasers here too. Um, they just go out of the wall. You can probably see where they come from. I haven't hit one yet. Yeah. Oh. Oh, just that just ended. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So just uh. Cut into the wall, uh, where it's bright at, uh, yeah, like that, not like that, I can't even see there, I'm just cut through the middle, oh my god, I actually died this part, it's amazing, it's so amazing I haven't died yet, wow, 
it's usually it's one of the hardest bat it's one of the hardest air battles there are in the game. So as we enter the land battle, um, yeah, one of the hardest air battles. Land battle's not kind of hard, give it normal. <laughs> okay, so yeah, I'm trying to make a video every day. It's hard to do. But this this place is kind of cool. This is bald arrows. Um, yeah, there are tricks here. Just follow the arrows. You can easily, uh, easily just evade these uh, guys' attacks um, and go just through them. <laughs> so just get on the grind rail and I'll just shoot these guys down. And hit the, you know, hit those little sensor things to make uh, the grind rail go farther. If you don't, it just drops off like. Oh wait, not like that. <laughs> now there's a platform coming up. Yeah, there's a platform coming up somewhere here. Alright, so just destroy these guys and another grind roll will come. This guy is annoying. He just takes three hits. It just takes longer to beat him than the other ones. You can't just melee him. And he doesn't really fight back. Yeah. I'm just gonna shoot these guys in long range. Oh, oh. That guy's invisible. No, oh, just defeat these guys and I grind more pairs. Okay, all right. Get the food along the way and yeah. And do not forget to switch rails here. The rail that you were on ends right about here, I think. So yeah, right there, it ends. <laughs> so just hit the switch. It's not really that hard. You just hit, hit all the switches to make the grind rails go farther. So yeah. Not that hard. I don't think you hit that one. You don't have to hit that one, I don't think. So just go in here. Oh crap, it's a bomb. Yeah, these guys just follow you and if you uh melee attack them they go up and blow up up there. So they you, you, yeah, it's all good. Uh, yeah. Alright, so defeat all the monsters in there and uh, the door will open. I'm pretty sure there's an intensity gate somewhere in here, but, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, mirror, yeah. so, uh, look at the mirror, and you see two rooms. One right here, which has a little thing in here. And then go and go across to see another door. There's another one of these tricks here. Um... There's, I think, three of these, and you just have to hit all of them. So, just look at the mirror, and you'll see all of them. Two, where's the door? Okay. Okay, wait. Okay. Yeah. The guy's sad. I mean, why are there food there? I don't know. I don't need them. This one's a little bit harder. You just have to look at the mirror while, uh... Yeah, I just fell. Hopefully I get hit through it here fast enough because I really hate this place. <laughs> so just go through here. He's like a little waddling. You just have to go slow through here. Yeah, so just hit this. Go back. Okay, so, alright, wait, oh yeah, this is, like, right. here, no, well, of course, no, oh, dang it, no, I'm probably just gonna skip through this place, okay, 
do this. So annoying. I don't remember having this much of a problem here. Alright, so we got past that. <laughs> Only one death. Hey Pit. Pit two. Two. <laughs> Dark Pit. Why would why would he be here? I mean he's kind of So like always just melee him or whatever. It's pretty easy to beat. And destroy this, uh just use melee attacks. Do not use uh, range attacks, we will just fire back at you. And yeah. So, yeah. And we're on the part two of the place. And go on the elevator. There's like an elevator in every level. I think I've said that before. There's an elevator in every level, I think. Some type of elevator. It is. But just go to the door. Unless you want the treasure all the way over there. And it just hurt me. Um, yeah. So just uh, ignore that guy and go in. Oh yeah. Yes. I love these things. Yeah. So if you um if you lose on this level, you can just go the other way, which is a lot longer, and uh. I, think, I don't know, the exo tank won't come back. So, yeah. So, just, uh, yeah. Just fire at this guy, come on. Hurry up. That's so darn annoying. This is just so annoying. Come on. What are you doing? Uh. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, finally. Hey, this guy. You gotta defeat that guy before everything happens. So just jump, and you're good. Yeah. So, there's a hot spring, and you go down. This is a really long level. <laughs> eh. through the doorway at the bottom. You should be coming upon him, I mean, I don't... This is making me smaller. Dang it, I'm really small now. That took a while to defeat him. Uh, I don't know about him. What about him? So annoying. This guy's just so darn annoying. Think this is an elevator? Yeah, elevator. So this is an elevator? Huh. Yeah. And then there you will come upon another elevator up here which is on this platform. Yeah. So not really many treasures here. Um there's like the last chapter there's some hatches ways um to get treasures on higher intensities, but that's pretty much it. Um Yeah. I think there's some intensity gates I haven't seen, but yeah. I'll look in the guide for that. Um like always, in the description below, there's always going to be an intensity guide help there. Uh, and you guys can comment on the video if you need help with that. And this thing is just so annoying. Yeah, so if you guys need help, you can just comment on the video. I mean, I'll help you either way. I always reply to people. Um, yeah. 
And I like the feedback you guys are giving me. I, I, I like it um, a lot, so thanks for that. Okay. Alright, alright. So, there's a treasure just there. Oh, uh, yeah. Just go up. Stupid. Die. Dang it. Talk about annoying. These guys are so annoying. Dang it. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you so much. Die, please. Die. Yes. Alright, so just destroy this guy. I like destroying these guys. It's so fun. Wait, where, where did that come from? Okay, that's locked. So I have to destroy the guy. Alright, so destroy that guy and the door should open right now. Oh, Jesus. Thank God. Alright, so, this guy's, uh, pretty easy to beat, um, yeah, uh, all you gotta do is, f uh, it's like, really, it gets really dark in there, so, uh, all you gotta find, all you gotta do is find where he's ranging attacks at, so, uh, yeah, where does attacks come from? It's like the camera's brighter, kinda weird, and the force is of nature, nature. alright. So this guy's really easy. He starts laughing and he kind of pauses for a bit. He's really easy to beat. Um, yeah. So they're coming from over there, and he's over there. So uh, he's pretty easy to beat. I just use melee attacks once he's down. So he's over there. Uh, wait, over there? Over here? Just gotta find where he is. I mean, pretty, pretty easy. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it's been a long chapter. Ah, sweet. Uh, 221,000, pretty good. So yeah, all you gotta do is find where his attacks are coming from, and you, he'll be over there. And then you just melee him out. Yeah. My guess it's the Chaos Kin, which will be in later chapters, so I'll tell you about that later. Uh, yeah, so that is chapter 13. Yeah. So I'll probably be making a game, uh, one tomorrow. Uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, and, uh, yeah, bye.